Hello, this is Dano's Outdoors. Today I am going to be showing you the March gun of the month, which happens to be a 22 caliber Belgium made Flaubert rifle, also known as a parlor rifle. These were made around the 1900s, 1890s, and 1910 era, and they shot a little 22 cap that was set down in the breech, which I'll show you. You'd cock the hammer back and lift the breech up, and this would slide out. You put your round right in there, put it back in, and right there's a firing pin. And then when you pull the trigger, it would hit that firing pin, making the cap go off. That was a the 22 cap. It was a black powder cap at the time. Not like a bullet they have today. So a 22 short would not work in this firearm. The caps themselves didn't have any gunpowder in them, but they did have a bullet. And uh, I think they reached up to 400 foot-pounds per second. And that was about the most powerful cap that they had. It's got a really cool design on it. So whoever made this one put a lot of craftsmanship into it. Also got that little marking there with the crown. That means it was made in Belgium. Now this one happens, the breech is broken right past that screw. And the wood is also broken. But as far as I can remember, when my dad had this rifle, it's been broken it's for the last 50 years at least. It's got the octagon barrel. It does have rifling inside the barrel. A little front sight. It's in really beautiful shape. I just show you the design right there. The engravings on the stock. This one was set up for a sling. Show you underneath it. Almost every bit of metal on this gun is engraved except for the barrel itself. If anybody knows anything about these guns, please put down in the comments what you think of it and any information. Uh, it's also known as a parlor rifle. The, uh, the rich people owned them pretty much and after they'd eat dinner, they'd retire back into their smoke room and break these guns out inside their room and shoot them right inside their houses. That's how hence the name parlor rifle became um, but it's a Flaubert, Nicholas Flaubert. He was a French guy who had his company in Belgium. Well, there you have it. This is the March Rifle of the Month. Please hit like and subscribe, and I'll get back with you soon. Thank you.